Marvel from Alpha Cars from our box for our showroom. We're checking out a couple of cool cars, but we are going to concentrate today on a very, very special one-of-a-kind Orion Reaper. We're going to have more of these vehicles, so please stay tuned. And if this one slips away, don't feel bad. We're going to have more of those for you very, very soon. This one, we, have, we were very lucky to get. It's a 2016, and it's a Reaper Sport. If you look into the lineup of the Orion Reaper for 2016, you're going to find that the Sport is a very interesting configuration. It's a two-door with a powerful four-cylinder engine. And if you haven't seen these vehicles before, please check them out. It's a rare engine. Here we have a four-cylinder, very nice, very good, very reliable engine. They've been around for a while. It is made by Sherry, which is the same company that makes it for John Deere here in the United States and a few other uh, big companies. As you can see, it has a dual exhaust. Again, four-cylinder engine made it to a five-speed transmission. And the best part of this vehicle is that it is considered low-speed vehicle, which means it can be registered for on-road use. Yes, that is absolutely true. This one has some really nice options. We've got the front bumper. We have an electric winch. We have a fiberglass roof. Rollover protection, cargo rack in the back, which lifts up like that. And then we have the engine cover that we can lift up and check out what makes this one a very, very special one. Look at this engine. Of course, it is a fuel injected. Here's the control unit that runs the fuel injection. Here's the timing belt. This particular one has less than 1,000 miles, and it's in close and new condition. I had a pleasure of driving it for a few days, and it is unbelievable. Yes, you can have it on road. You cannot take it on highways, and there are very specific regulations to operate sport, sport vehicle, a sport, um, I'm sorry, low speed vehicle for on-road use so you need to be familiar but yes it can be registered and while it is a great off-road vehicle it can be used on road has a very simplistic interior but nicely done this one is in great condition we locked out with this one it's a five speed three pedals engine in the back all-wheel drive system with locking differentials Shifts beautiful, has windshield wipers, has a radio, which is optional, um, and has a cute little glove box. Check that out. Oops, look at that. Cup holders in both doors, has a kill switch right there, uh, hazard lights, uh, four wheel drive, two wheel drive, electrically engaging, and we have. Two keys for this vehicle any one of them should start the vehicle we checked it out we did all the service work including we put a new battery you can see a nice instrument cluster and the vehicle starts right up let's check it out yeah sounds like a old Toyota Corolla engine old meaning uh, you know that the ones that were produced in the 80s it sounds great it's got a nice loud tone from the exhaust check this out let's walk around this vehicle it has great looks when i was driving it without exception every motorcyclist and it was a nice day every motorcyclist waved and smiled and when i parked it uh, at the store there were a lot of people that came out to look at it while we're still in the showroom let's look at the suspension independent double wishbone suspension you can see uh, serviceable um, joints 
disc brakes, adjustable shocks, great tires, nice rims. This one also has a trailer with the seven pin, with the seven pin connector, braided hoses, lead us to again to the disc brakes, parking brake system. Well, let's check it out outside. Very easy to operate clutch. Let's put it in reverse. Parking brake off. Oops. Sorry about that. That was not reverse, but now we are in reverse. And we're backing out. Clutch feels great. Gonna put it now in first gear. Shifts beautiful. Feels really, really nice. Excellent steering response. Almost feels like a go kart, but you sit much, much higher. I'm gonna park it in front of the building and we'll take another look at the vehicle. You can definitely feel the tires are knobby tires. Something you need for the off-road. But we had this car on the road at regular road speeds and a little bit of humming noise, but it, it feels great. So this is how 2016 Orion Reaper looks in front of Alpha Cars building. This is an amazing vehicle. And again, you don't see many of them. We were lucky to have them, to have this one, and we will have more. I don't think we will have this one for long, but don't feel bad. We will have more of them. As you can see, for some of the engine, on the left you can see a dipstick, timing cover, alternator, Force on the engine block in black, and up top we can see the force on the engine head leading to the exhaust manifold that goes down below and splits into the two exhaust system exhaust systems with the spring uh, connected flanges. Very very smart, high performance. And now we have two mufflers, and we have a great looking on-road vehicle, low-speed on-road vehicle that is allowed in most of the states. Definitely check out your regulations. We're in the state of Massachusetts and New Hampshire. It is confirmed that these can be registered for on-road use as a low-speed vehicle. We're also gonna pop the hood. Check that out in a moment. We're gonna look at a couple of compartments here. Little tie down there. The roof comes off nicely. It's got tubular roll bar. And then the roof comes off with just undoing these four nuts. Uh, and this is all metal. And it's got a nice liner coating on it. Again, this is all metal. The fender flares are fiberglass. The hood is fiberglass. But it is a unibody construction that sits on the frame. Look at this. Uh, obviously, there's not much you're going to put here. This is just access area for some components, including the gas tank. And that's where you fill your gas tank. Here's the suspension with adjustable suspension. Here is your master cylinder for the brakes gas tank uh, evaporative mm -hmm. system right there windshield washer tank radiator up in the front there it is LED lights here's a nice looking 
racing radiator as you can see unibody mounts on the two inch extensions they go to the square frame nice underbody protection again we're back to the discs this vehicle is also i have to mention that it's very much serviceable on both on the parts availability and how easy it is to service if you go on the orion website on orion website orionmotors.com click on parts you can see every single part for any of these vehicles that were sold in the united states including most current ones great manufacturer and they've done a great job here in the united states delivering one of a kind exciting product thank you very much for viewing this video my name is dimitri and i'm the general manager of alpha cars and motorcycles here is it, we, I'm reporting from our Boxburg showroom. We also have locations in Northampton, New Hampshire, Spencer, Massachusetts, and we have showroom in Acton, Massachusetts. So please stay tuned on our YouTube channel. You can also visit us at alphacars.com, A-L-P-H-A-C-A-R-S.com, or simply give us a call at 978-263-9000. Thanks again.